here's my political views. I'm pretty much an independent. You know, I'm I'm pro-gun, I'm pro-choice, I'm anti-big government, um, I'm anti-capital punishment, which a lot of Satanists aren't. I just feel like, you know, killing people for killing, killing people that kill people doesn't really solve anything and it hasn't done anything to reduce murder rates in this country. So it really doesn't work. Um, people kill people because they're crazy. So, you know, the threat of death it usually isn't a deterrent for people who really want to kill somebody. Um, but yeah, I mean, I as far as uh, the most recent election, Obama, I voted for Obama primarily because he's young. You know, I, I don't really follow politics that much, you know, especially when it comes to his, you know, supposed plans on, you know, reforming America and the economy. I could really give a shit. After all, the president's really only one third of the judicial system. So, you know, and also I, I think presidents and a lot of politicians are just kind of puppets anyway. Um, so I really don't think it matters all that much who is elected president as far as to what goes down. Um, interesting point about presidents is some of the founding fathers of this country, you know, were uh, quasi-Satanists. I don't know if they can call themselves Satanists, but they definitely practiced some, uh, some satanic traditions and whatnot. Uh, Benjamin Franklin, Thomas Jefferson, George Washington, uh, that's just to name a few, were part of an elitist underground quasi-satanic thing called the Hellfire Club. Um, and people don't realize, a lot of people don't realize also, is that people who came to America were people who left England looking for a better life, looking to get out of the repression of the English, you know, the UK and English society. So these are people who, a lot, a lot of them were, you know, uh, religious extremists, you know, both good and bad. And um, a lot of them were criminals, you know, that were coming to look for a new life, to start a new name for themselves. And oppor opportunistic people, people who were... Um, you know, adventurers. Um, anyway, yeah, that's my take on politics. You know, I, I really don't, I really don't follow it that much. Um, I kind of, you know, believe people should have the choice to do whatever they want. You know, with little, with as little government involvement as possible.